fish is so versatile, Richo. Don't you think you can bake it, you can grill it, you can fry it? Today, I'm going to steam it. I'm going to use this beautiful fresh baby barramundi mm. and I'm going to put all sorts of gloriousness, that's what I like to say, ginger, garlic, herbs on top, in the middle, underneath, and we're going to steam it. Is that a new Priya word, gloriousness? Yes, it is. Have you noticed I've used yep. it a few times today? Now, I've got some herbs here. What you do you want do. me to do? You do. I just want actually you to chop the whole thing, literally the stalks, the tops, including the coriander roots, a gotcha. lot of flavours in there. Gotcha. These are really classic Asian flavours. I like these flavours. Yes, good. Very simple. Lots of strong flavours in there. So you yes. like the way barramundi can hold strong flavours. I do. I love Chance. barramundi. So, Richo, all I've done is cut slits like you cut it in your meat to get the flavour in. I've done it with the fish. I like that. And then I stuff some garlic and ginger in there because it's going to steam through the flesh. Then, Richo, I'm putting in some garlic and ginger inside the fish. In the guts. In the guts. And then I want you to please, very delicately, with your big paw, put some of that in there. Go okay. for it. So coriander and spring onion Perfect. in there. Is that delicate enough That's for you? That's delicate. Right. Wonderful. Thank you, Richo. Okay. Now, this is when I'm going to move over to use some glad foil. Okay. And I'm going to do a really easy steaming method. I think when people hear steaming fish, they think of having to get the steamer out and it's really messy and tricky and getting enough water. This is the easy way. I love it. So, Richard, can you put, yes, a bed, a bed of the herbs. Oh, I love that. Beautiful. Look at that. So as the fish cooks, the flavour yes. or the aroma of those herbs and the yes. garlic and ginger Correct. come up through it. I love that. Now, what I'm going to get you to do, Richo, is I'm giving you the really important job to finish off the gloriousness. Can you please combine, I've got some soy sauce, sesame oil, rice vinegar, a yep. little bit of water, really beautiful flavours that are going to combine and then go on top of our... Baby Barra, and she's going to get nestled here. Pour, that on Pour the, the whole thing on. Now, you want to make a bit of a boat here so that you don't lose your beautiful sauce. And then all I do, Richo, is I do this at home, and I'm sure that there is another way. Just to twist it around like that? Yeah, perfect. Yeah, great. I like that. Like a little I bonbon. do like a swan. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, and that's going to go in the oven on the bake function for 35 minutes, and then this is going to be ready to go. This smells... So good. Don't you think, Richo? It smells fantastic. The garlic and the ginger and mm. the sauce. I think the sauce has been fantastic. The ginger is oh. the real hero here. And I'm going to give you the very pleasant and slightly tricky job, Richo, of getting that onto the plate. Easy. Whip that off there. Get rid of that one. Can Grab the go? tray. Okay. And then I'll get a palette knife like this. This is a pro tip, everyone. Pick it up on the bottom like that. And the fish should swim straight off. There we go. Little fella. Beautiful. Nice and gently. And all that juice, don't you leave that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, beautiful. Look at this. So easy in the oven. The juice Oven is the, steamed. The so excited. And we can chuck some fresh spring onion on that. We've got some rice as well. You know what? It looks like a bought one, doesn't it? It does. It looks like one you get at a restaurant. And everyone at home has now seen how easy it is to do. Really simple, really delicious, really good for you. In we go. OK. He's oh. gone for the best bit, which is always the tail of the fish. That's where there, there's no bones there. There's no bones in the meat. I think Ooh. it's... I don't know if it's a myth, it's sweeter. Yes? It, and it's really sticky, the skin. Mm. So that's a good sign. These flavours, though, mm. sesame oil, soy, it's mm. it's hard to lose at all with this. This is the winning combination. The thing about barramundi is the flesh is really soft. Slightly oily, but really soft. Mm. And it takes all the flavours and cooks beautifully. And, of course, it's an Australian fish, mm. which is really important, but that is beautiful. I'm glad you like it, Richo. Next time you come for dinner, I'll pop that on the table. I can't wait.